Hey everybody, welcome back to their brand new video. Today we're doing a random box opening. I think this is the first time we've done this in a while. We've done some random pack openings in the past, but I figured let's switch it up a little bit and do some random boxes. We have boxes from as far back as 2015. We've got some 2018 boxes in here. We've got some 2023. We've got some 2021. A lot of these boxes are, you know, mid-end to it's a little bit on higher. And I think that the most expensive box is about $200 here altogether. It's going to be over $1,000 worth of the boxes in this video. I think we have, if I added them up correctly, $1,350 worth of boxes. So thank you very much for joining us. I hope everyone's having a very pleasant evening. We're going to do some more breaks tonight live if you'd like to join us for that. We'll be concluding our team breaks tonight, so there's still some rounds available. If you'd like to get involved, come by and check it out. Just chat, watch what we pull, or just hang out. But anyway, Juan Cortez... You're up first. We got a box of five star in here. These boxes are about $200 a piece. And inside, you get two autograph cards, five star. It's kind of like a lottery ticket box. Let's see what we can find in this one. I'm hoping that we can get you something good here. One, one was in our silver pack video the other day. And let's see if we can get something to go with that uh, blue U Darvish colored card that you got. I think, didn't think you got too much out of your silver pack. So let's see if we can get you something good out of here. So we start off with a Tanner Houck. That's a purple rookie auto. It's numbered to 50. And your second card is, wow, there we go. Bryce Harper starting things off right. A big Bryce Harper on-card autograph right there for you, Juan. You don't see too many Bryce Harper autographs in uh, any of these products. I could probably count on one hand how many Bryce Harper autos we pull in a single year. That's an awesome card right there, Juan. Congratulations. Big hit right there for Juan Cortez to start things off. All right, where should we go next? How about we try a 2023 box? This is a 2023 Signature Series Active Player box. John Nordstrand is going to pick one of these up. And let's see if we can pick up a nice J-Rod Bobby Witt auto in here. I hope it's not some bum, but, you know, that's the odds are that it's going to be probably just... Uh, Five to ten dollar card. That's what these boxes usually will give you, but there is a chance to find really good cards. Maybe a ten percent chance. We do have a Diamondback right there, so we have a Diamondbacks player. It is going to be. It's a nice pitcher for the Diamondbacks, Zach Gallen, who is uh, really becoming a star. That's out of forty nine. Zach Gallen from twenty twenty one big league. For John Nordstrand. So, John, thank you very much. I think now let's try an older box. We'll go back to the oldest box we have here. This is 2015 Strata, which would be for Tamara. So, Tamara, let's see what we can find for you in this one. We had Tamara involved in the Throwback Thursday the other week with some 2008 Bowman Chrome Series 2. Let's see if we can find something in this one for you, Tamara. All right. Good old Strata. I think usually it's one auto and one relic in here. And sometimes that relic can be autoed as well. So we have Kendall Graven. That's numbered out of 75. Rookie auto. Of course, he's now kind of, I don't think he's in baseball anymore. And Sonny Gray having a great season this year. That is a nice big piece of his jersey. And it has an autograph on there as well. That's a very nice card. Sonny Gray out of 25 for Tamara. Unfortunately, um, the Kendall Graveman is not the biggest hit, but hey, we'll take it. Sunny Gray. Where should we go next? Let's find an Otani rookie card. How about we do that? 2018 update. Got a couple of these boxes. These hanger boxes now, want to find one of these, they're about 110 bucks on eBay. You could have had these for 10 bucks back in 2018, which is pretty crazy. So let's see what we can find for Isaac. And probably even less than that is a lot of times 2018 products ended up in the clearance bin at Walmart after a few months. Because back in 2018, people weren't buying too many cards. All right, Isaac, good luck to you. Let's see what we can find. That pat side of the pack is being a little bit stubborn. We're trying to find you an Otani rookie card in here. And I'm hopeful that we can find... A parallel. If we can't find the Otani, hopefully you can find some other good ones. There's Ozzy Albies, which is a good one. Also, of course, you probably are familiar by now that Roland Acuna Jr. has a rookie card on this along with Juan Soto. 
And for my money, the 2018 set is the most beautiful set in recent memory. Just look at these designs, and I really hope we pull a parallel. Because if you haven't seen these before, the parallels are gorgeous. The entire background is all paralleled up. All right, so far nothing. There's a Bryce Harper pulled his autograph to get things started in this random box opening video. We've got Garrett Cooper, rookie card. Juan Soto, rookie card. That is the rookies. Insert rookie card of Juan Soto. Very nice. Juan Soto having a good year now after a slow start. Here's the legends in the making. Soto, Acuna, and Otani all have rookies in that set. Unfortunately, there's not one there amongst those three. And let's see what else. So we got a Juan Soto for you. Do we have another one? There's a Glaber Torres rookie card. And unfortunately, that is, I mean, it's not a bad box. You got a Juan Soto in there. Could have been worse. You could have had nobody. Thank you very much, Isaac. Really appreciate that. Where do we go next? How about we try, I see this Bowman Inception box. Just sitting here calling my name. We'll go with Vito. Vito is up next at spot number oh, i guess it's there's no number for this this is the only bowman inception box we have well, good luck to you Vito. if you'd like to buy a spot in any of our live stream breaks or like our team break tuesdays and i guess now it's wrap up wednesday we're going to be wrapping up the team breaks tonight we sell all those spots on patreon as well as spots like this one on patreon you can grab a spot in these standalone videos here we go bowman inception from 2022 usually a couple autos in here averson artiaga out of 50 is a nice one and we've got Luis Mesa out of 250. Those are going to be our two autographs, Colton Kowser and Harry Ford, to wrap that one up for Vito. Thank you, Vito. I think, uh, what should we do next? So many choices to go with here. Um, should we go with another Strata box? Let's finish off the Strata. I got two Stratas. This one is for Jackie Roach. So that last one had a Sunny Gray and also a Kendall Graveman. Let's see if we can find a big superstar auto in this next box. Good luck, Jackie. I could already see the back card. It's a player that has been released this year. And the top card, how about that? Johnny Bench, Hall of Famer Johnny Bench on card auto. That is a gorgeous, he's got a gorgeous autograph, Johnny Bench. Out of 50, Jackie, congratulations on that one. And we also have... Your Relic, which is going to be no auto on this one. It's an Eric Hosmer out of 75, along with a little sticker. You type, you type in MLB Authentication on Google. You type in that code on that sticker. It'll say exactly the game that Hosmer wore this jersey. I always like to look at that to see if they hit a home run in that game or did something special. Then that would make the card worth even more. So a really nice Johnny Bench. Jackie, congratulations on that. So we had Johnny Bench, Bryce Harper, my two favorite pools so far. Let's try another one of these lottery ticket boxes. It's going to be 19, 2019 Signature Series. We did a vi I bought a case of these. We did a video on these on Sunday. We pulled a one of one A-Rod out of there, but not much else. So let's see if we can... I was, I was just thinking, there's probably something else in these last few boxes. Really, really good. Let's see if Brian can find it right now in this next spot. This is going to be a retired player. It's going to be a signed buyback card. It's Steve Sachs, and it's an OPG. OPG Steve Sachs from 1989. So Steve Sachs, former Simpsons star, I guess. He appeared on the, the, my favorite episodes ever, The Simpsons, where they were playing as the, uh, what was it, the Isotopes or something like that, the Springfield Isotopes for Homer's softball league team. All right, next, how about we go with, some chrome black. Chrome black is always a fun one. Has a little pack of three cards, and then it has a slabbed up autograph. And we got two of these. Raymond wanted two of them, so let's see what we can do for you here, Raymond. Let's start off with the three card pack first. We've got a Dylan Carlson rookie leading things off, and then we've got Matt Chapman in there as well. And the slap. Oh, look at this. Mariano Rivera. We are pulling huge hits in this video. A Mo Mariano Rivera autographed card from Chrome Black. And it is not expired. This is the 2021. So they usually give you about two years. That is, that's the best card by far, I think. I mean, Bryce Harper is great. Johnny Bench is a, a fellow Hall of Famer of Mariano Rivera's. But I, me personally, I grew up just 
I loved Marion Rivera. He was one of my favorite players for many years. And I really wish we could show you this actual card. He's got literally the most beautiful signature that you will ever see. Marion Rivera does. And uh, man, Raymond, you are going to get this one. Can you believe that, Raymond? Amazing, amazing pull right there. That's three big pulls in this video. And uh, we're not done yet. We still have more to come. We have another 2018 box as well. Let's check out this other box for Raymond and see if we can find something else amazing for him. So we have Lance Lynn. There's Zach Granke. And we've got Miggy, Miguel Cabrera in there as well. That one will be numbered. And your other slab, it is going to be a Koei Arihara. So you can't win them all, Raymond. That's the next one up. Man, what a nice, nice pull that was for Raymond, the Mariano Rivera. All right, so Raymond also ha has a Stadium Club Chrome Blaster Box from 2020. These are actually quite expensive. If you go on eBay, the average asking price is about $65 on these boxes. They are not cheap. Uh, they didn't really make too many of them. I guess that's why. So I saw this sitting on the shelf. I was like, let's go back and revisit some 2020 Stadium Club Chrome. I can't remember the last time. I've opened one of these. All right, so we have four exclusive base card parallels right here. And there's just four packs in here, just like there was for regular Stadium Club Blaster Boxes, except all of these cards have that nice chrome finish on them. So 2020, the big rookies are Beau Bichette, Luis Robert, Jordan Alvarez. Let's see what we've got here. See if we can find any of those guys. There's a Shed Long Refractor, Ken Griffey Jr. Juan Soto in the midst of doing the Soto Shuffle. Danny Santana. Two Danny Santana cards. One of them being a Refractor, Ramon Laureano. Tyrone Taylor rookie card, John Lester Refractor. We've got Randy, Randy Rosarena rookie card. It's a nice one. We've got a Beam Team Shohei Otani. That's a gorgeous card right there. We'll get that one sleeved up. Gavin Lux, rookie card as well, who's out for the year with an injury. And we're not done yet. We still have this little base card parallel pack as well to check out. Looks like these are going to be the X-Fractors, which nowadays, they just go ahead and toss these right into your packs. You don't get that extra bonus pack anymore. They put them in the middle there, which I guess is fine. So, Raymond, congratulations, man. Big haul for you today. Let's do that 2018 box right here for Kevin Newman. So, the first box for Isaac did not produce an Otani. It did give us a Soto, which is awesome. Let's see if we can get a Showtime out of this one. Or an Acuna. There's Glaber's rookie card. Wonderful ever return. There we go. Showtime. That's what we're looking for. Kevin Newman gets it. That is the Shohei Otani rookie card. That is our fourth big hit from this video. Very, very nice. The Shohei Otani rookie card. Get that all top loaded up for you, Kevin. And what we really want to find is, I mean, the Otani's nice. You go into a box of 2018 hoping to find that. But what we really want to find is a parallel of Otani. We found a gold Otani a couple weeks ago here on the channel. Dominic Leone hogs up the gold spot in this one, unfortunately. We've got Evan Longoria, rainbow foil card right there. And here comes the inserts. Another one. Showtime times two. Legends in the making. I love that card. Very, very nice. So Kevin hits two Otanis, the base Otani, and he gets a bonus. The insert Legends in the making Otani rookie card as well. That's a good box right there. Love hanger boxes for 2018 update. Very, very nice stuff right there. We'll have a round of this, another round of 2018 update in the team breaks tonight. I just added a, another round of that. If you're interested, you can check it out. Next, let's do a Chrome Blaster box from 2020. I had this sitting on the back of a shelf, and I was like, all right, let's go ahead and see if we can find Boba Shett's rookie card in here. Kimberly Q is going to get this one. Good luck to you, Kimberly. You get a little pack of four sepia cards in these. Again, with 2020, we're looking for Jordan Alvarez and Bo Bichette, Luis Robert, Randy Rosarena would be nice. I don't think Rosarena is in the base set as he was in the update set. 
this? Well, you know what? He probably is because he did have, after all, Randy was in Series 1 as a Cardinal, which is pretty interesting. He's got a Cardinals rookie card and a Rays rookie card in 2020. So he could be in here, probably will be in here. Let's hope he is, along with some of his other buddies, maybe Tony Gonsolin rookie card, Dustin May. There's Pete, Pete Alonso gold cup. And so far, nothing in here. There's a Gavin Lux rookie. Jose Altuve, Kyle Lewis rookie, who's amongst the fallen rookies of 2020, him and Aristides Aquino. And here's our sepia cards. That four-card pack, unfortunately, did not hit any of the good rookies in there. So we're going to wrap this one up with a couple blaster boxes. Boom and boom, these two. It's 2019 update. Michael Vitolo grabbed two of these guys. We're looking for a Vladdy rookie card in here or a Tatis rookie. How about Tatis? Up to, what, 13 home runs now, and he totally missed the first month of the season. So if you kind of equate that out, 13 home runs in about a month and a half. It's about a, oh, I don't know. There's a Mitch Keller right there, rookie car, which is a great one. Probably like a 40, 50 home run pace if you would have played the whole season. There we go, Vladdy rookie card. So Michael Vitolo adds a Vladdy rookie card to the haul today in this video. And we'll see if we can hit a parallel. We've got Martin Perez gold. Yes, Monty Grandal, that's the foil stamp. Those aren't numbered. And looking for Tatis, Pete Alonso rookies. There's one Pete Alonso rookie. That's a home run derby version. We'll get that one sleeved up. He also has a rookie debut version in here as well. Ronald Acuna Jr. with the Gold Cup. Commemorating his home run performance. And Tatis is in there. What a nice box. So you basically get a, and another Vladdy. I always forgot. These two are always back-to-back. -back. So, Michael, that was a very good box. You just got four of the good rookies, the Chase rookies, all in one hanger box. Can't really complain about that. I'd be super happy with that one. Let's see if your second box is anywhere near as good as this uh, last one was. This is actually this is the last box of the video, folks. Again, thanks for joining us tonight. There's a Pete Alonso rookie on the back. After I'm done with this video, I'll get it uploaded, and I'm going to go do some team breaks if you'd like to join in. Brian Reynolds' rookie card is a nice one. I think we're going to start things off tonight with some jumbos, some 2017 update jumbos, 2018 and 2019 update jumbo. It's a three jumbo mixer round. We'll get started with that. There's the Vladdy Rainbow. Very nice. Vladdy soaring in the six rainbow card. And we'll see if you have anything else. We do know that there's a Pete Alonso on the back end here to close this one out. Tanner Roark, JT Realmuto just hit for the cycle. A couple of his cards in there. And we wrap it up with Pete, the All-Star Game version. So Pete Alonso actually with three rookie cards in this, <coughs> this update set. He's got the Home Run Derby, he's got the All-Star, and he's got the rookie debut. So that'll do it for right now, folks. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys have a great rest of your Wednesday night. I hope you can check us on our live stream tonight. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and uh, tomorrow we'll be back with a brand new release preview of the brand new Panini 3 and 2, so check that out as well. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later. Good night, everybody.